Uh, I have a lot of poems about weeds, because weeds are one of the few wildlife that we really get to uh, enjoy if we let them kind of come around. Um, so this is a poem simply called Weeds. They have great names, you know, if you use a little field guide, they have great names. Horseweed, quackgrass, creeping jenny, goosefoot, beggar's lice, bachelor's buttons. These days it seems I have more interest in the names of weeds than in the breasts of women. Their homely titles remind me of the early Zen master Shu Lao, whose name also means a small, dirty pool of rainwater along the road. Ribwort, pigweed, fleabane. With my children trailing behind me, I wander the yard and beyond, spending the afternoon searching out these ragged little monks. By evening, I put down my pocket guide and wait on the porch for darkness. Suddenly, a little poem comes to me out of nowhere, and I write it down on the page of my field guide. In the poverty of a single weed, the solitude of a thousand mountains. Um, this next poem is